God's word, the Holy Bible, it, it is not just for encouragement, it is for correction as well. It is not just full of love, it is full of judgment as well. It is not just promises, it is full of warnings as well. My brother, my sister, my friend, God's word, the Holy Bible is a double-edged sword. That's what we read in the book of Hebrews chapter 4 verse 12. So wake up and do what all is says in order to be safe, in order to be wise. My brother, my sister, my friend, in the book of Isaiah chapter 1 verse 19 and 20 says like this, if you are willing and obedient, if you are willing and obedient, you will eat the best of the land. But if you refuse and rebel, you shall be devoured with a sword for the mouth of the Lord has said. You got it? See, verse 19 is a promise, is a blessing. Verse 20 is a warning, is a curse. My brother, my sister, my friend, wake up, wake up. Bible is not like a buffet where you can go and choose what you want to eat. It is like medicine. You have to eat the whole thing. Brother, sister, my friend, wake up. Stop taking God's word, the Holy Bible, for granted. Stop taking it for granted. Don't do that. Don't do that. Many of us, we just want to hear only those good stuff, only those encouragements, only those things which are soothing to our ears. We don't want to hear any warning. We don't want to hear any correction, which is not good. Wake up. See, in the book of Amos, chapter 9, verse 10, God says like this, All the sinners of my people shall die by the sword, which say, The evil shall not overtake nor prevent us. God is talking to his people, to us. He says that all the sinners of my people shall die by the sword, which say, the evil shall not overtake nor prevent us. You see, there are so many people who talk so confidently saying that the grace of God will protect us, the grace of God will protect us. Like that, they are deceiving themselves. They are fooling themselves. That's what God says. My brother, my sister, my friend, wake up. God has a face of love and he has a face of judgment as well. Wake up my brother, my sister, my friend. In the book of Revelation, chapter 22, verse 11 and 12 says like this, He that is unjust, let him be unjust still. He which is filthy, let him be filthy still. He that is righteous, let him be righteous still. He that is holy, let him be holy still. And behold, I come quickly. Jesus is telling, behold, I come quickly. And my reward is with me to give every man according to his work shall be. You see, there is a reward for every man. For good and evil for right and wrong for every man there is a reward which is coming my brother my sister my friend wake up and stop taking Bible for granted know what it says believe what it says obey what it says in the end you too will be glad you did it 
and you too can walk into heaven with a smiling face when you close your eyes upon this planet earth my brother my sister my friend god loves you jesus loves you i love you until we meet again may god continue to be with you as well amen hallelujah